Well, here's the ambiance on the outside. Big shopping area here in Fremont. And we're at the little hot pot. This is called All You Can Eat Hot Pot. And the food just keeps coming. $44 a person to eat all you want. These tables are very interesting. Everyone gets their individual hot pot. And you order a soup base and then you order your main course, whatever it is that you want. I happen to get the Taiwanese spicy soup base and the premium beef. So we're making a sauce now. Create your own sauce. Create your own sauce. What if you don't know how? Try. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I'm gonna I'm gonna follow you one. So yeah. Show show us the way. Kiki's gonna show us the way. No, oh, she doesn't know either. It's the blind following the blind. Yeah. You get these little dishes and you proceed to make your own sauce. This is the ginger back there, this is the garlic, this green onion, some cilantro, it's a jalapeno back there. So we have sugar and salt to begin with. And then that's garlic right there. Uh, green onions. Green onions. We have some ginger. Oh, guy have ginger. Have some jalapenos. So some garlic. Some ginger. Green onions. So we have one with ginger right here, ginger and green onions. And this one is garlic and green onions. Put a little cilantro in there. And then some jalapeno. Put the jalapeno in with the ginger. Sorry, jumping in. And we want. The dumpling sauce. Okay. And then the garlic, we want the peanut sauce. Kind of like Thai. Here we go. Oh, yes. Tell me what you have in this concoction right here. I don't know. You don't know? Well, there's, it looks like sesame seed on top. Yeah. It looks like. 
Yeah. And then you have some peanut, secret peanut, sauce. Yeah. <laughs> peanut it's secret sauce. sauce. Peanut, peanut sauce. Peanut sauce, okay. But I don't know what else. I and there, there's some ginger in there, or what? what is that? That's garlic? <laughs> Okay. That's the one you want to look at right there. Oh yeah. yeah. That one is interesting. Now, show me what what's that one right there? Well, it's like a traditional uh, uh, Taiwanese hot pot sauce. With All the, right. So, so Kenny's the, got what in there? That's for the Chinese barbecue sauce. Okay. A little bit of soy sauce. Kind of bit of garlic. And then you crack the egg in there and Whoa. you beat it up. Nice. So you get this consistency. I can't do and that. And the idea is that you, with the half boiling food, and you dip it in here, it, it cools it down, and also it coats the whatever that you uh, put in there. So because of the egg. It'll be nice and creamy, yeah. Yeah, nice. And you cook in the same time. Oh, I've got to see that in action. Mm -hmm. Level three, Taiwanese spice. Uh, that's me. Level, level three. That fits right in there, and then she turns on the little control down here. Oh, I'm a P5. P5. Five. 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 So look at this. It's a Taiwanese spicy soup base. And it's uh, spicy from one to five is a three. So when the soup base is boiling, well look at that, it's already in boil. And you put your beef in, and then you throw in your vegetables. And then when it's ready, you put it into the little bowl here. And then you add your sauce. Here's the vegetable. You know, don't forget the job with Kenny and Juan. <laughs> that they have to empty the plate. Excuse me. And there are your the utensils right there, all you need. Yes. Oh, look at that. It's boiling. So we shall go ahead and put in some vegetables. Just put in, uh, and I can cook. Uh, the secret for the meat is that when the thing is boiling, yes. dip it in real quick so it's not overcooked. Well, I like more of I cook. I let my my meat cook. There's a fish ball. I just put in the vegetables that I take a long time to cook. Yeah. Yeah, I put the, the carrots first. Bring the corn. Yeah, that's good. If I can stay there for a long time. And the balls can withstand a lot of cooking too. How do you like the boss cooking? Uh, well done. <laughs> and then here's the beef. What are you talking about again? You're being dirty minded again? Here we go. Let's let that cook a little while. You gotta see how everybody else is doing their uh, hot pot. Everybody got their own fiber pot. So we, we learn techniques. Isn't that true? One techniques are very important. Absolutely, it's all about technique. Technique and timing. And people eating your food. And sharing. Look at that sharing. Yeah, see, sharing. You know, it's sharing like when it. you invite someone to eat your food. When somebody just snatches your food, it's not sharing. What do you call that then, Juan? You call that thief. <laughs> That's grand theft the, soup. The full robbery. I'm, I'm glad Kiki's on that side of you then. Oh yeah, she'll be eating yours too. Someone said that she's got a hollow leg, is that true? She's got both hollow legs. Ah, there you go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, Janice is doing the uh, seafood there. So the secret is you get you get your beef like this, then you dip it into your secret sauce. Like this. And then you consume this. Here we go. We're consuming it. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's really good. You have the option of taking from your secret sauce and putting it 
on to your meat here in your eating bowl and then going from there like this also very good I would think this fish ball will do best right here in this sauce right here it was like, okay. Delicious. It is delicious. Soup is four on the scale from one to five. Oh my god. And mine is a three. But the difference between a three and a four is like it's like the Richter scale. It's like a, a, a factor of ten times hotter between three and four. So I can imagine how hot the five is. So my favorite is the beef in the peanut sauce. Last time I see all you can eat, the food just keeps coming out and one feed, you can just keep eating and, and until you burst. And then after a while, the soup base is also very edible. You just pick up the bowl and drink the soup. Very flavorful. Service is very good here. They keep refilling your drinks and they'll bring extra, they'll bring extra napkins and more soup base. And they come by and make sure we're okay. <laughs> well, the side that is not the all you can eat is really busy right now. But the all you can eat is basically all done. Well, I ate everything. And the secret sauce is still one of the most important aspects of this meal. So you see Janice is putting her corn in her own concoction of secret sauce. Like it. Well, the clam at the end was the piece de resistance. The what? Just wonderful. Ah. But I had too many charms, so I got this really long yeah. silver. But Kenny, great company. Kenny got me these charms the other day. And I fantastic love conversation. Yeah, I so. love the little sendo. Uh -huh. Doesn't get too much better than this gang. I've had enough uh, hot so spicy to, to last about a week. Yeah. My vocal cords are on fire. And then for dessert, we came over here to the Snow <laughs> Crave. The Snow Crave Tea House. place to come for dessert. There are people hanging out here. The ranks of that. We have here, according to one, a couple of Big Macs. <laughs> Let's get those a little closer. Wow, they're big Big Macs. And there is a lemon tea. Oh, milk tea. Thank you. That's, uh, that looks wonderful. It's a milk tea. And it's got tapioca in there. Press on Jay. We're going to ask for mom. Now what kind of tea no, is this? Like, I just like the, the mixed fruit, fruit tea. And mixed it's fruit tea. No sugar, wow. no nothing. It's made you like the pot again? I like the pot. I don't have that. It's right. Huh? Comes in a little thing. And, nice, and then it's soft. But I'm going to need to keep the tea nice and hot. So what we have here is red bean soup. And it also has the rice ball in it. We'll get some little bowls and share this among about three of us. Here. Yes, with the tea flavor, so make it not heavy. Great way to finish off a very nice evening, friends.